Breaking news in the rock feed, a truly shocking statement just in from one of the biggest metal bands in the world. Moments ago, Slipknot just announced the departure of drummer Jay Weinberg. This after the band has dealt with multiple membership changes in recent years. Back in 2019, percussionist Chris Fain left the band amidst a legal dispute with the group. And earlier this year, the band announced the departure of longtime keyboardist and sampler Craig Jones. And now the shocking news of the departure of drummer Jay Weinberg, son of Max Weinberg of the legendary E Street Band. Jay Weinberg is known for being a lifelong fan of Slipknot. There is that famous picture of him backstage with his father meeting Slipknot as a kid. It's one of the things that made him so appealing to the Slipknot fan base was that you know that Jay Weinberg was a legitimate fan of the group. He has a stellar reputation. I've never heard anyone say a bad thing about him. And certainly during his tenure in the band, he was a very, very good drummer. And it is sad to see him depart from the group. A lot of questions have been opened up as a result of this decision. It is quite frankly shocking. And I am at a loss for words as Slipknot is one of my favorite bands of all time. Uh, sometimes you hear rumblings about things that might be in the cards or might be happening. And this is not one of those things. This truly came out of left field. I, I imagine you as well. Uh, the fans are shocked by this as much as I am, but I want to get to Slipknot's statement. And then we're going to talk about the ramifications of this and, uh, maybe do a little bit of light speculating on what this could mean for the group going forward. So first, this is the statement just in from Slipknot about that shocking departure from Jay Weinberg. Here is the statement which was released by Slipknot on their social media accounts. It reads, we would like to thank Jay Weinberg for his dedication and passion over the past 10 years. No one can ever replace Joey Jordison's original sound, style, or energy. But Jay honored Joey's parts and contributed to the last three albums, and we, the band, and the fans appreciate it. But as ever, Slipknot is intent on evolving. The band has decided to make a creative decision and to part ways with Jay. We wish Jay all the best and are very excited for what the future holds. A creative decision. These words in this statement have been undoubtedly meticulously combed over you can read between the lines i am going to begin speculating on this and uh, i have no inside baseball on this situation i have no idea what is going to occur but i would like to allude to what is possible and i want to be clear i have no idea what is going to happen i am shocked by this uh, Jay Weinberg, by all accounts, is a world-class drummer and a world-class person. And so as they noted, it's a creative decision. For them to make this kind of a change, in my opinion, there is maybe a deeper loyalty that might be involved than even a world-class talented drummer like Jay Weinberg. Now I'm gonna speculate a little bit here and I'm gonna say I have no inside baseball on what is coming next, but I just wanna point out, in my view, as a person who loves Slipknot, who has followed them for most of my life, if I could hand pick someone to join the band after Jay Weinberg, who would I pick? Who would I choose if I was in control of making this decision, I wanna say? This is not whether or not this person's interested. They may or may not be. I'm not saying they are. I'm not saying they aren't. I'm just speaking for me. If I was in charge of choosing who could step into the band, who would make the most sense? If I was clown, I would get on the phone and I would call my son, Simon, who is the drummer of Vended, who is a monster talent of a drummer. If you watch him play, he has it. Watch him play for real. And so for me, if I could hire somebody, I really like Simon and I believe he possesses the discipline and the talent to do that if he was interested. I don't know if he's interested. I have no idea. 
I am, I'm sad to see Jay Weinberg go. I really thought he was a great drummer. I believe he's a good person. I look forward to what comes next to him. And we've heard a lot about members of Slipknot retiring in the future. Here's a little bit from a conversation I had with Corey over the summer where he talked about his future touring in the band and a lot of the wear and tear he's endured over the years. This is the selfish Slipknot diehard fan in me. Uh, you really think that you will retire at some point in the near future? You deserve it. I mean, you've done it all. I mean, I've, I've, I've already said that physically, I maybe have five years left, but at the same time, I go out of my way to tr really try to take care of myself. Yeah. Now, I have a lot of miles on me. Yeah. It's hard for me People don't realize this, but it's uh, when I walk, I'm almost in constant pain. I didn't know that. Yeah, I know you've had the knee. I've had the knee. Yeah. It's, it's the knees. It's my feet. Um, I, you know, I have a broken toe on this foot. I have gout across my feet. Oh man, and it, and it, it goes, it gets up into my joints and shit. Um, yeah, it's it's tough. It's it's. I'm not as nimble as I used to be. I'm not 35 anymore. Right. It's it's hard. Um, but there are ways to do shows yes, that don't are. require being that crazy. Now And crazy travel. Well, that's the problem. It's the travel doesn't lend itself to being healthy. Right. Because at that point, it's not like being home. You have got all your stuff. You kind of at the mercy of the of what's there for you. Sure. So you're gonna eat like shit. You're gonna sleep like shit. You're gonna feel like shit. Yeah. And home. nine times out of ten, you're gonna play like shit. Yeah. And we don't want that, right. you know. So it's so it's tough. Even a even a guy at my level, it's not always, you know, laid out catering and you know the the best food, totally. the best people. It's sometimes it's true. It's a soggy sandwich at twelve thirty in the fucking morning, it's and true. you're looking at it going, if I put this in my body, I'm gonna throw up. It's not glamorous. It's not. That's what people and people don't fucking get that traveling is. Rough. You know why they think that is because that's all they see yeah. on Instagram, yeah. on TikTok, on this and that. And you're seeing the commercials. It's a grind. Yeah, it's it's fucking sad. The man, there have been times we've gotten off stage, we've gone right to the airport, flown out. We don't sleep until seven the next day, and now we're just all up, man. And our Crew gets it even worse, right? Because they have to fucking go in, make sure everything's good, and then they can go fucking take a nap. So it's not it's not gravy all yeah. the time, man. It's it's tough. It's hard fucking work, even at our level. Right? It's hard work. So we do not know what happens next with Slipknot, but I know that just like myself, all of you guys are shocked by this. I truly didn't see this coming. I would like to thank. Jay Weinberg for his very good contributions to the band. He is a world-class drummer, and I'm really looking forward to what he has going on coming forward. We will keep you posted on this situation and let you know what we hear. That is your latest update from Rockfeed. Be sure to subscribe for the latest news and updates.